Scampton, Lincolnshire. The last Lancaster bomber still flying had a rendezvous with surviving dam busters on the 24th anniversary of the raid on the Myrna and Ada Dams. Dr. Barnes Wallace, inventor of the bouncing bomb, was present for the reunion with men who successfully put one of his great ideas into effect. Both wore the dam busters tie. Bill Howarth and Fred Tees had nostalgic feelings as they looked at the rear guns. A flood of memories surely for Jerry Witherick, DFC, DFM. To serving officers of 617 Squadron, the name Guy Gibson holds the place Nelson has in the Navy. And the Lancaster is still revered as the best bomber produced by any Air Force in the World War. Vaughan, Reverend J. Williams and R. Kearns. Their thoughts going back over the 24 years. Kearns, DSO, DFC, DFM. Jeff Rice, DFC and Bill Townsend, CGM, DFM, would have loved to fly the aircraft, but that was not allowed. But just to feel the controls was enough. Wing Commander Gibson VC, who led the great Lancaster raid on the Ruhr Dams, escorts the King during a visit by their majesties to an air station in the north of England. Wing Commander Gibson's brilliant achievement was accomplished with the support of a gallant band of brother airmen. They too received the congratulations of the King. The breaching of the dams was superbly executed and resulted in enormous damage and dislocation to Germany's war industry. Describing the raid, Wing Commander Gibson illustrates with the help of pictures how the attack was carried out. Descending to within a few feet of the reservoir and taking the full brunt of the defences, Wing Commander Gibson achieved one of the most devastating attacks of the war. The floods created a serious situation in the Ruhr Valley. Finally, we interview the wife of Wing Commander Gibson at her home in London. You must feel worried about your husband sometimes, Mrs Gibson. I'm worried all the time. Would you like to tell us why? Well, I don't know. When they go out on these raids, you never know whether they're going to return or not. You must be very proud of your husband. So proud, I can hardly tell you. Perhaps you'd like to say a few words about him. Well, if my husband's efforts and all the boys in the services with him can bring this war to an end so quickly, so much the better, and then we can enjoy ourselves.